This channel is supported by my online fishing courses at saltstrong.com slash Skinner, as well as my books, and you can learn more about the books at johnskinnerfishing.com and on Amazon. All right, I am here. This is a long time coming. I'm fishing with George Skaka with Freshwater Fishing in Florida. George is responsible for basically my lifestyle because he's the one that got me uh, my first writing job back in the mid-90s with Nori Saltwater. So thank you, George. <laughs> well, actually, John, you say that a lot, but the truth is, you know, I'm successful because of people like you. Well, you know, we had great teams. You were uh, just a natural and I mean, we've been friends for how long now? Yeah, long Over time. Over 30 years. But this is the first time we're fishing together. <laughs> All right, we're going to go yeah. fishing. All right. Yeah, so I'm using uh, this Humminbird Auto Chart Live. You wouldn't believe it. There's no chart for this area because it's right. a private lake. So you have to make your own? See, it makes my own chart. The thing is amazing. Do you golf? No. Okay. I've always thought they should combine the sports, like yeah. tournaments should have golf and then when you're waiting at the hole you should you know yeah. fish and they should you know somehow work out a point system for tournaments so you have to combine golfing and fish Been using these prop baits, and I'm telling you, these things have been working. So, yeah, I've never used one, so that would be a good thing to use for me. So, I like this one, this, this little thing, and I'll show you the way I fish it. And I'll have links to all of the gear in the video description. And if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. Well, let's make a so you just reel this thing slow? I don't, I've never used a prop bait. Yeah, so here's what you do. Here's what I do. Here. So I'll, as soon as it hits the water, I wait a second until kind of circles leave. And then I'll go, and you see how it splashes towards the front? Okay. So when you get that splash, you wait. One, one, two, wait. And what will happen is these things strike at it. I don't know why. They'll, you'll never hook them on the first day. It's just wow. not going to happen. So you got to give them slack and let them eat the freaking thing. But you want to slash uh, it. See how it splashes a yeah. little bit? So then we'll know right away what's working. That more you'll be able to see better what I'm talking about. Like the prop pushes water forward. Uh-huh. They're kind of you'll see that splash. And that tends to attract fish. Should I be casting? You can if you like. You never know if But you know, we literally I'm hoping to see a blitz here. Really? You're, you're gonna see <laughs> you're gonna see one. At one point, they're like bluefish blitz. Yeah, this one definitely splashes a lot more. Yeah, you see how it, you get that splash forward? Yeah. That, that's what you want. Alright, now you can't get in too deep if you read. Yeah. But that's where you want to be. I'm going to save that top for you. You ever seen these ducket rods? What are they? Ducket? No. Wait, I got to move a thousand. Um. Got him. All right. Yeah. They must be thick in here. <laughs> Looks like a large bear. Uh, hey, I'll take anything. You know, yeah, I haven't well. caught these guys in a long time. All right. 
lunch or something. Hello, guy. It's a pound. It gives me a little confidence in the lure, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's only a... There you go. Right. No, I think I was like third cast, yeah. Oh, you got him? Good, good for you. It's got to be a peacock, I believe. Quite a nice peacock. It's a peacock. Those are peacocks. I'm turning up and around. Uh, it's a good fish here, Johnny. Decent fish, anyway. Oh, yeah. Peacock. Oh, I got looked at. Nice. <laughs> there you go. You know, he seemed bigger. But... I'm not going to complain with him. He gets back around there. Um, you know, we have eagles, ospreys, and as far as fish, we have huge gar. There are snook in here. Um, not that anybody really targets them, but you get them on this type of thing. Absolutely, they'll hit all this, yeah. You know, and, uh, we have the lions, the largemouth, the peacock, we have huge catfish, we have crappies. Look at that kiss, come on. You know, I don't fish for any of that other stuff. But every now and then you catch a gar, you know. Yeah, I catch them when I'm tarpon fishing uh, on the jerk baits in the river. Well, a couple, about a month I'd say, maybe two months. Oh, there you go. Is it on? King, of the, it king of the little guys, yeah. You know, I've been halved once by a gator. You know, I mean, it's going to happen to us at some point. There, there will be a gator following us around somewhere today. Always have. Come on, right there. Nobody underneath that dock hearing that thing popping. Come on. There's got to be somebody at home. I know it's kind of weird that you don't get a great bite under the docks here. Yeah. I mean, when I'm throwing a lizard or a wacky. You know, and I guess it's shady right. Like it looks like it's shady right. <laughs> yeah. Right. I mean... Look at that, come on. Can't make a better cast than that. And plus you got that thing working perfect. You, get, you got the splash idea. I don't understand why people don't get what I'm trying to do. <laughs> I fish a little bit, so it's... Yeah. Uh, A little too much weed. That's all right. Sometimes they're in there. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you know, they live in those weeds. You can find a chute where they can get out. There you go. <laughs> Not a little guy. Just get to the little ones to get the big ones. And we're due for a big one. This is exactly snook fishing, you know, yeah. pounding the shoreline. Nice. That's a pound and a half right there. I told you to go back over the same spots. <laughs>
Laura, everybody's going to get dressed and uh, dance for you. Oh! That had uh, Got him. I did what I told you not to do. <laughs> <laughs> Only I didn't, I was getting ready to hit it, you know. Man. Up there you go. Yeah. Right. Just watch him though. Yeah, he, I'm, I, he's a, he's barely crazy. hooked, and uh, I got my trusty pliers. Off he goes. Yeah, because man, they they're the ones they got me twice already. Yeah, and it's significant. Yeah, I believe you. Oh, there we go. There you go. Hey, that's a better one, huh? A little better. Ah, huh? Little guy. I thought it was a nice swirl there. No. Pounder. Oh my God, they're so expensive, like $30 for like, oh, you know, these stupid little things. But yeah. I wanted to catch one. I figure if I'm gonna make the, you know, the effort, I'm gonna do what everybody says you're supposed to do. So I did. And it wasn't like the spawn or anything, so. Yeah. It was. Well, but, I gotta uh, tell you though, know, I just got back. Oh! It's a nice hit. Yeah. Yeah. I got to see a you know, good blow up on that. Nice. This is a better one. Oh, yeah. That one's over too. We'll be catching and people will be like, why don't we do this? Why don't we try down? I'm like, you never leave space to find it. Like right now, I want to leave, but there's obviously some creatures. But you're right, you know, it's funny. You got that bite on when the saw was going. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, with the snook, it, it's the the accuracy you need is oh, there's a fish by my lure. The accuracy that you need is oh, oh. <laughs> it's really annoying. Yeah. Yeah, you mean with the mangroves? Yeah, you got to be right on that edge. It's a peacock. Oh, nice. I kept it there, like you said, you know. Yeah, that's what you got to do. Can you imagine we just have a single? There you go, huh? Last year. That's a nice one. Yeah. Yeah, and it was exactly what you said. You know, I, I, I saw him around it, so I. Uh, you didn't move it. Yeah, I, I kept it there. Yeah. There we go. Just wanted to get his, his color in there. Environment. Oh, I knew that was a good. Come on. Ah. He's back. He's back. Oh, he's all. Oh, there he is. Got him. Got him. Got him. Oh my God, he just was all over that thing. <laughs> it was a perfect That's cast wild. into that corner too. Boy, they are aggressive buggers. Peacock? Yeah. Oh yeah, baby. Ah. Ah. The beauty. The beauty. Loving it. Oh, there's a little gator. Boy, they're tiny. Oh, some of them. Oh, that's a tiny one, yeah. He's going after your look. Is he really? Yeah. 
You can't sit there again. He's gone. Oh, I thought. Hey? I thought I saw a fish too. He's turning on the burners. Watch it. He'll get it. They get pretty fast. <laughs> No. M Mark hits. In which case they're not doing as much damage to us as it would seem. Right. Way to go. Coming up. Oh yeah, there you go. Coming up. Oh, oh nice. Don't want to drop. Don't want to drop. Don't like doing this like this. <laughs> hey, why don't you have them in the mouth? Oh, I do have them in the mouth. No, I mean... Oh, I should have flipped them, but yeah. I couldn't get them. I just couldn't. That's a hard grab. There Usually you go. Usually I do. All right, that's a better one. <laughs> Whoa! I was just going to ask you if it's top water is still okay for this time of day. Oh, definitely. Yeah. I'm throwing this not to take your top water away. Well, it's good that we throw two different things anyway. Yeah. Yeah, but I, I this is an 80% top water bite. Oh. Oh, come on! There you go. That's too bad you can't spot lock. Yeah, oh, I didn't know you could. Okay. Lock. Oh, there's a fish with him. It's a peacock. Awesome. Yeah, nice. Very nice. Yeah. Uh, fourth, actually. Yeah. Fourth, the root count. They go nuts, right? I love how they play. I gotta tell you, the peacock fishing in October was so good that, and I didn't come until, you know, the second or third week. I may come early. <laughs> I know there's great fishing in New York, but yeah. something to be said. So. <laughs> See if you can see fishing right in my backyard. Well, I have the Albies right in my neighborhood in Greenport, so. That's true. For me, I gotta get lucky. And, and blackfish. And yeah. I know, they are hard to walk, you know, that's always been... Oh yeah, amazing. you do jig for them now, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, I mean, it's just unbelievable. Well, how much fun are they? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. He hit on the retrieve, you know, when, when you say get the retrieve going, you know, just yeah. to retrieve it. Yeah, I just didn't see the, the... That's a nice one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's a beauty. Look at that, huh? Oh, yeah, baby. Spin around. This is beauty. Yeah, I know about the about the hooks here. Yeah. Because they are not largemouth. When yeah. you grab that mouth, then they go. Yeah. Really? 
really should try because what you do, huh? You're gonna be like me now. Is window. got him? It's not big. Oh, it's too bad. All right, not it's not bad. And, and there's a lot, man. Yeah. There you go. Another good one. We got a good bag today. Oh yeah, baby. That's not like a good one. That's okay. good. There we go. Nice. So, you know, pro problem with the insurance here is like we have Citizens, which is a state backed insurance company, mm -hmm. and they have um, a rule that if you're a, a full time, if you're a homesteader, or, you know, full. Oh, look at that in there. Never mind. That's a freaking, that was a nice boil. Ah, uh, wasn't terrible. Oh, it wasn't terrible at all. <laughs> that's a peacock. <laughs> it kind of looked like a peacock. I could be wrong, man, but that thing. No, it's oh. a nice freaking largemouth. Is it a largemouth? I think it is, yeah. I think it's a peacock. No, 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 no. That's a nice fish. That's a big, uh, like or a decent, it's a nice largemouth, yeah. And, and I saw him rise and I spot casted him or sight casted him. Okay. It's a nice fish. That's what we were looking for. Yeah, Johnny, we would have killed him today. You and me? What a bag we would have had. Two and a half right there, maybe. Nothing wrong with that. I tell you, my shoulder's just feeling better. I tell you, I tricked and I hit my eyes. I my oh boy. Got him. Did you? Yeah. Oh, good, good peacock. Yeah, baby. Look at that beautiful fish, huh? Oh, yeah. Wow. They are something. We are so lucky wow. showed up here. What's that with his head? Got going on. I gotta on. get a picture of this one. That's, uh, that's a male that's ready to sport. Look that's at that. That's what that is. I gotta get this one. I wanna hold him out properly without getting a hook in my hand. Yeah. So you're saying this won't knock them out? I thought that they would just... Listen to me, you gotta hold them really hard. Cause that fish is gonna turn on. Okay. Alrighty. Whoa. You see them all? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, eight, nine, all right. Oh, oh man. Come on. Can you beat that? Oh, so that was just a really fun day on a part of the Florida fishing that I, I just don't even, you know, partake in. Uh, thanks so much to George Skaka for getting me out there near his home. And uh, yeah, it's uh, really a spectacular fishery having. Um, you know, so many peacocks now moving into so many different areas. All right, if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. Check out my online courses at saltstrong.com slash Skinner. And don't forget my books, and you can learn more about the books at johnskinnerfishing.com and on Amazon.